HH o haka inde hichilema blocking Edgar Chagwalungu for him to stand for that presidential seat. A lot of people they are saying that Haga Inde has blocked Lungu. Is this true? Is this true? Or what really happens in the government if you are in power? What really happens? If you remember back then, 2021, uh, Edgar Chagolungu was eligible to stand as a president candidate. But this year they are saying that 2026, Edgar Chagwa Lungu is not able to stand as a presidential person or as a presidential candidate. What really goes on in these these government things? You know, this really shocks my, me, and uh, and I was so damn disturbed to see that uh, Edgar Chagwa Lungu was not eligible. But wow, in 2021, they are saying he is eligible. So does it mean that Haga Inde Ichilema is in fear of Edgar Chagwalungu? Does it mean in that way? Because to my own opinion, I can say Haga Inde Ichilema and his team, they are in fear if Edgar Chagwalungu stands for presidential election, he will take over the governance or you take over the state house. You take over Zambia once again. So, in trying to do that, they are trying to block him. You see? Or oh, what does the constitution law say about... <laughs> you know, I'm so behind, I'm so behind, I can't understand this, I can't. <laughs> You know, whenever you're in the government, there are so many tricks that really happens there. I don't know if Edgar Chagolungu had some issues with those guys there, so they had to say this and that, that he is eligible, and I don't know if the uh, the UPND government, they're just trying to block his way to make it to the presidential seat, I don't know. You know, one thing that we cannot deny is that the people of Zambia, they are really in love with Edgar Chagwalungo. They really love him and they really want to see him once again on that seat. And looking at what whatsoever everything that they are happening or whatsoever which is happening in the country, uh, whereby people, they are, they are in deep, deep troubles they think that maybe if they were to take uh, Edgar Chagwalungu back into the state, then that man will change the lives of so many people. And some they are saying that what is happening in the country is something which is so shocking, such that the lives of people, they are in deep mess. That's why they really want Edgar Chagwalungu to be back in the governance. Now, as for me, I cannot say the court is saying that he cannot stand because it is written and it is it is what it is, you know. So, you know, there are a lot of corruptions that really happens in this. I'm not saying somebody had to corrupt him or had to say this. No, but I'm saying there's a lot of things happening. There's a lot of things happening in these sections. Only the people who are in front, they really know what is happening, as we cannot know. So let's see where these things is going. But if, Ed, if Edgar Chagolongo was able to stand in 2021, and if the constitution truly said that he's able to stand, and this year they are saying, or the court is saying that he is not eligible to stand, then which means... Haka Inde Ichilema is in fear of this man. 